So, you want to be a blue devil, huh? Well, you've come to the right place. I'm Kevin Zen, and this is to get into Duke University. First, let's take a look at what Duke itself has to say. Under their What We Look For page, the admissions team wrote, We're looking for students ready to respond to opportunities intelligently, creatively, and enthusiastically. We like ambition and curiosity, talent and persistence, energy and humanity. I also decided to investigate Duke's mission statement too, but I won't read that one out loud because you'll see in just a second. Now, I've personally read and analyzed dozens of these college websites, mission statements, Statements. Most are pretty similar, but here's what's special about Duke. Let's start with the mission statement. They actually mention some pretty interesting phrases like promote health through medical research and thoughtful patient care, as well as provide wide ranging educational opportunities using the power of information technology. Most importantly though, are these two key words from the What We Look For page, energy and humanity. You see my friends, what makes Duke truly stand out amongst all the other top 20 colleges is its absolutely contagious school spirit. Harvard, Yale, MIT, yeah, they're pretty dope schools, but not really known for their packed stadiums. But Duke is. In fact, attendance to sports games is so coveted that students camp out in tents for basketball tickets in a tradition called K-Bill. And it's not just basketball either. Duke has incredible top-notch athletics programs which have been nationally ranked for decades now. Lacrosse, even soccer, baseball, tennis, golf, you name it. So if you're planning on applying to Duke this year, the number one thing that I would mention is tangible proof or evidence of how you have actively promoted school spirit in the past. Have you organized pep rallies, designed school gear, or hosted campaigns to improve attendance at sports games? To convince Duke that you belong there, it's not enough to just write, I look forward to being part of a community with lots of school spirit. Instead, you're gonna wanna write, as someone who has organized every pep rally for the past three years and spent dozens of hours obsessing over marching band formations, I can't wait to do the same at Duke. I'll bring my special skills in baking, fundraising, social media marketing to promote events like Kville, yada, yada, yada. See the difference? All right, friends, I hope you enjoyed that quick little break. Moving on to humanity. Something you guys should absolutely write about in your Why Duke essay is Duke Engage. Basically, Duke Engage is a community service program that allows Duke undergrads to study and address social issues through a summer abroad with a host community. If you wanna get into Duke, I absolutely recommend, no, I'm going to require that you guys go through and watch this playlist called My Duke Engage Story. There are some really fascinating stories that honestly struck a deep chord with me about privilege, assumption, discomfort, and growth. I'd specifically reference one or two that left an impression on you in your Why Duke supplements. The videos themselves are pretty short. They're not longer than like six minutes each, so they really shouldn't take that long to watch. Check out this video from student Mike Wong, whose perspective on religion totally changed after fasting with his host community from Jordan during Ramadan. My recommendation is to connect an activity or experience you've had in high school to an opportunity that Duke Engage offers. For instance, if you volunteer at the local mosque or you work with refugees from the Middle East, you could write about how you're looking forward to doing something similar to what Mr. Mike Wong did. This is one of the most important lessons you're going to learn, not just in this video, but on this channel. To get into your dream school, whether that's Duke or anywhere, weave a cohesive narrative between what you've already done, what you want to do at Duke, and what you hope to do upon graduation once you're equipped with a Duke education. But wait, there's more. Another crucial tip you have to know whenever applying to anything, anywhere, always keep an eye out for brand spanking new programs. On Duke's website, they're promoting this new group slash initiative called Quad Councils. A quad is basically a dorm and Duke is now actively searching for student leaders to establish new traditions and host events. If you're someone who has worked with a bunch of student organizations in the past, done stuff like student council or worked as a camp counselor, talk about how you'll take what you've learned, the kinds of traditions that you've helped establish and apply them 
to make your future community a better place. Here is a personal example. I went to boarding school in New Hampshire for four years, and as a dorm proctor, we established a ton of tradition. Whenever someone was featured in the school newspaper, I'd cut out the article and then hang it in the dorm for all to see. And on Friday and Saturday nights, we'd host these insane board game and video game competitions that would last until like one or two in the morning. Now, those are the sorts of things that I would say I would be proud and honored to bring to Duke University if I were applying today. Before you go, don't forget to like and subscribe since we'll be offering discount codes for essay edits and for our services later this year. Finally, let me know in the comment section below which school I should do next and what other kind of content you'd like to see. Thanks for watching, my dear virtual little sibling. Catch you on the flip side.